Hi everybody, I have just a really quick project for you. Um, I was at Walmart the other day and my Walmart finally got the Cricut Light cartridges. Um, and I got Celebrate with a Flourish. This is the one of the Cricut Lights that I had to have. So, um, I got it and really excited. Um, unfortunately, the only major holiday that's not on here is um, 4th of July. So, can't do a 4th of July project, but... Um, I will be doing one of those soon, but right now, um, I was just kind of being random and I wanted to do, um, an Easter project, um, just because I had some papers and stuff, um, just some scraps that I wanted to use up, so I'm using this and we're going to do this, um, Hoppy Easter, it's really, really cute, and, um, we're going to be using these shadow boxes, um, I've used them before, um, in some other of my videos and I really really like them and I'm going to be using them again um, in another project as well um, but we're going to be using those and um, I already cut out the Hoppy Easter um, and I put it all together there's um, a couple different layers there's this white shadow and then um, you cut the main image out in this It it's green it kind of looks like a yellowy green but it is green um, and then the pink layers and then the yellow layers so I cut all those out put them all together um, and I already put some pop dots back here Oops. and um, so this is a really simple project I just cut this piece of paper that is four and a half by four and a half which is the same size as um, the inside of my um, shadow box and um, it looks kind of yucky right now. This is actually kind of <laughs> um, what these shadow boxes look like when you buy them. I've cut it up and ripped it a little bit on the edges, but we're going to cover it so it's not a big deal. Um, so I'm just going to um, adhere it down. Let me get a better angle here. Um, just going to get my regular adhesive here and put it down. And you don't need a whole lot because um, we are going to be um, gluing or hot gluing this back into our shadow box. So it's not a big deal. It's not going to come off. Um, and then what I did is I cut an extra shadow for um, this image so that I can put this straight on here. And that way, even when you turn it... Um, see this is going to be popped up even when you turn it it's going to have that shadow back behind um, you could do this in a different color if you wanted to it's totally up to you um, but yeah we're just going to do it in the white and I'm just going to adhere that right down with this um, regular little glue tape runner thingy Okay. And I'm just going to try and center it as best I can here. Maybe. Okay. Okay, and then we're just going to adhere this down with our pop dots. I tried to put them in places where you won't see them. Um, when you even when you turn it and it's white so it should be pretty good um, because our shadow is white and everything else so okie dokie there's the one I missed I was looking for it okay and then you just you gotta really line this up as much as you can I think I'm actually going to um, do these pop dots and do them double just to make it pop out even more. My shadow box is plenty deep for us to still be okay. If we do that. Oops. Okay.
It's okay if they're a little bit off. They don't have to be perfect. You're not going to see them anyway, so. Okay, okay. One more. Okay. There we go. That's about right there. Okie dokie. Now we're going to line it up again. <laughs> okay. It's nice and dimensional. Just like that. Okay. And then um, all you have to do is stick it right in your shadow box. And I like to hot glue them back in. Um, and there we have, I think it's so freaking cute. Totally, totally cute. You could put, like, if you if you could find some little eggs, um, like little miniature ones, you could put them inside there. That would be really cute. Or a little baby chick or something like that. Um, the Cricut Light does have a couple of images. There's... Um, that I'll do, I'll do like a whole set. I'll do the bunny and the chick. Um, I'll show you really quick here. So there's the bunny, and then there's a basket with eggs in it, and then a little chick. And they all have flourishes in them, which is like amazing. There we go, you can probably see it better now. But yeah, um, so I'll probably do like a whole set, um, like a set of three, um, with this being the middle and then one of the chick and then one of the bunny and I think it's really really cute so really simple project um, and really easy and really fun so I think it's really cute and I uh, hope you liked it talk to you later